Sometime in the evening hours, I get up a call from the main guard upstairs. He tells me that there are strange lights flying over the facility. They're looking at reddish orange glowing pulsating light that's hovering just above the front gate. And he pointed with his arms and he says it was right out there hovering, uh, motionless and without sound. He did think that there was a solid object within the light, sort of oval shaped. I kind of dismissed it. I even said, you mean like UFOs? And uh, kind of laughed at him. And he said, well, they're not airplanes, sir. About five minutes later, he calls back, and he's screaming into the phone now. He's very frightened. He's babbling. He said he's got all the guards out there with their weapons drawn. And they wanted orders on what to do. I told him, make sure nothing enters the fenced area. When I hung up the phone, I thought we were under attack. By who or what, I had no idea. And then we get bells and whistles going off at our control panel. And we could see the lights going from green to red all across the board, meaning the missiles were inoperable now. If the president had given the order to launch the missiles, we could not have launched them. 